Hi everybody, my name is Hannah and this is Pepper and Pine and I have a project to share with you today. We are using the Nature Watch Classroom Kit for the Moon Phase Game Kit. It comes with all the supplies you need in order to do a memory game using these little tiles and cards and stickers to show the different phases of the moon. It also comes with information that can complement this lesson, so we went ahead and we read that information before we did this project. So it comes with enough materials for 25 students. Each student will receive eight of the white and black tile markers and then a sheet with the stickers. And then you also get a little answer key, which is really important, especially if the children aren't familiar with the different phases of the moon and their names. So you get two sets of stickers and one set is going to go on these black tiles. The other set's going to go on the answer key. So I've got my six-year-old and my 11-year-old working on this project and with just a few directions they were able to do it entirely on their own. Now we want to put the answer keys onto the little white tile markers. However, that is probably not the best thing to do first. I think that writing in the answer key is better because while the stickers are still on the sticker sheet, they are in the correct order. We had extra sticker sheets, so it wasn't a problem, but if you're doing this for the first time and you only have one set, it's better to go ahead and write in the answers on that moon phase answer key first before you do your white tiles. Once we had the white tiles complete, it was time to put our stickers onto our answer key. And then once the stickers were in place, then my kids went ahead and wrote in the answer for each of those moon phases. I went ahead and I wrote them in for my six-year-old daughter. And then the last thing is to actually play the game. And this is the fun part, and it was actually a little bit challenging. Even though there aren't that many tiles, it was a little bit difficult to do this because if you're unfamiliar with the phases of the moon and their names, you have to keep referring to the answer key in order to check. I also like that the phases of the moon are real photographs and so they really give a nice realistic look rather than a hand-drawn look and that is what also adds to the challenging part of this game. It also comes with a little baggie to store all of your tile pieces as well as your answer key and I really love details like that. Then it all stays in one place and all the students can take their little game home with them. So this works really well with our astronomy unit and if you would like to see the complete playlist of all the activities that we've done with our astronomy unit you can tap on the screen right now and if you want to see some of the other kits that Nature Watch carries you can tap on the screen right now as well because we really love these kits and we have used them a lot in our homeschool.